when people ask me uh, what is the thing that I love most about Macalester, I always say that it's a, you know the premier urban liberal arts college. We have access to so many nonprofits, volunteer organizations, businesses. It doesn't cut to just be talking about policy in the classroom. You really have to get out there and see what it looks like on the ground. I'm teaching a course called The Economics of Poverty in the U.S. So I worked with Paul Shadwell in the Civic Engagement Center uh, to create more hands-on or real-world experiences in the classroom. We took a field trip into the north side of Minneapolis um, to, see the north, to see the farmer's market and see how benefits are being um, applied to people with lower income. We met with one of the staff there and we talked about uh, the farmers market's efforts at uh, helping North Minneapolis residents gain access to fresh, affordable uh, fruits and vegetables. It kind of gave a face to the, to the policies that we were studying inside the class and made it um, a lot more of a real subject rather than something purely theoretical. So I literally gave them a slip of paper that had a person's name and phone number on it and they were in charge of calling them up and finding a time and a place for them to meet. We went over to her house and interviewed her and photographed her. If I was in a more rural setting, there just wouldn't be the resources to do a project like this. And this is exactly the kind of assignment that uh, a website or a magazine would assign a professional photographer. Go out, get this person's story, edit it together, bring it back, and do it in a really short amount of time. We got to go to Stone's Throw Urban Farm. It's a, a small farm run by Mac grads. We talked to one of the Mac graduates who is currently running the, the farm. They sell their produce at a farmer's market, and they also run a, a CSA, Community Supported Agriculture, so they're actually bringing their produce directly to families in the Twin Cities. They began to see how what they were doing in the classroom could actually have a real impact in the lives of real people. Being in a city affords McAllister students a much wider and broader experience. 